Hi friends, welcome to my channel Civil 3D Pro Designer. As you know, we already started chapter number 12 and today we have exercise number 2 how to create parcels using the lot lines tool in AutoCAD Civil 3D. The first few buttons on the parcel layout tools toolbar are used for basic parcel segment drafting that is similar to using basic AutoCAD lines and curve commands. As you can uh, see in this table, we have four commands. We can use these tools to draw parcel freehand or to retrace geometry that already exists in the drawing. We have the first add fixed line which we will uh, also practice in this exercise add fix free curve add fix curve two points and radius draw tangent tangent with no curve so these all and other commands and tools part of parcel we will practice in this exercise please watch complete video to learn how to use lot lines tools in AutoCAD Civil 3D. Before starting, if you are new on my YouTube channel, you can visit Civil 3D Pro Designer to learn a complete course of AutoCAD Civil 3D from chapter 1 to chapter 18. Now you can go to playlist and you will find chapter 1, 2, 3 like this. So you must need to start with chapter number 1 and then go on. Let's have a look at our exercise number two. In this exercise, we are going to draw new parcel geometry using the parcel creation tools command. We will also create a common area parcel near the entrance to the development as well as parcel representing land that is remain the property of the individual owner. Step number one, open the drawing name using the lot lines located in the description link you can download drawing from the description link if you did not get you can write me i will provide you that i already open using the lot lines drawing step number two on the home tab of the ribbon click parcels and then you need to select parcel creation tools it will open parcel layout tool bar which we have many more commands which we already look at the table step number three on the parcel layout toolbar click add fixed line two point here you can see when you will hover your cursor you can find add fixed line two point when you will click it will open create parcel dialog box to you then click ok to accept the default in the create parcel layout dialog box it will ask you specify first point okay step number four zoom in to jordan court road near station zero plus one hundred here we have jordan court alignment jordan court road you can find zero plus hundred yes here we have zero plus hundred it's a curve and hold down the shift key and right click to open the object snap connect context menu when you will shift press shift and right click you can see your all snap you can select any any command here we will see step number five click end point then click the end of magenta curve at station 0 plus 1 to 8.13 shift and press enter to select end point now we need to select 0 plus 1 to 8 station when you will click here it will select and now you can draw your parcel Step number six, hold down the shift 
key and right click select perpendicular now i want to click here perpendicular so i have transparent command right a shift and you can right click you will see here perpendicular click the magenta back lot as shown in figure like this press cap twice to end the command so when now we already select perpendicular when you will go here it will find automatically your perpendicular click and enter exit so you can see it has been created property at with parcel step number eight click parcel parcel creation tool on the home tab of the ribbon here again we are going to create any other parcel click draw tangent tangent with no curves you can find here draw tangent tangent with no curve when you will select this line it will also open create parcel dialog box click ok to dismiss the create parcel dialog box and you can accept these all default settings it will ask you specify start point step number 10 using the end point object snap trace the fence line that surround the existing form building begin at the north end of the fence and work toward the south and west so we are uh, going to create this area as a farm house which we want to make a parcel in civil 3d it's our start point shift press right click and you need to select end point select start point then here 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 and here if you will not close your parcel line it will not create your parcel so we need to click anywhere here we need to check our step number 11 once you have select the last point on the fence use the perpendicular object snap to select the western boundary line yes here press shift and right click you will see here perpendicular when you will click here press enter and escape you will see here we have create property 10 as a parcel for farm house so you can draw your autocad entities before creating parcel and then you can follow them using lot lines tool to create parcel in AutoCAD Civil 3D. Step number 13, 7, close your drawing. So hope you like this video. If you want to learn more and want to learn a complete course of AutoCAD Civil 3D, you can subscribe my YouTube channel, Civil 3D Pro Designer, and you can also like my Facebook page, Civil 3D Pro Designer, where you can get many more material related to AutoCAD Civil 3D and 